Hello, welcome to a Comic Link auction preview. This is, uh, I'm shooting this video November 1st. This auction will kick off November 17th. It is the last major auction with Comic Link. Okay, every year, November is the last auction. They do not have a December auction, so this is the feature auction. For those that are not familiar with Comic Link, they have two types of auction. They call features and focus. The bigger books, the more important books, the big dollar books, the mega keys tend to go in the feature auctions, while the lesser books go into the focus. But if you pay enough attention to comic link auctions over the past many years, even um, with focus auctions, there are some major keys from, from time to time. Okay, so it's not exclusively. Now this is there's still 16 days left to consign your books. So if you're thinking about consigning something, you still have time. I'm gonna hold off. Okay. I have about four books that I want to submit to this auction myself. But I want to see what happened with the market, the stock market that is. Um in the next three days okay because the election is two days away i want to see how the market react in the next few days and if things look good stimulus uh, issue the fed printing money you betcha i will ship those four books maybe even five to be included in this auction so for now as you can see the thumbnail this will change okay as more books are added to um, this auction Comic link will adjust this, but just looking at this, you can see Batman 3.0, All Star 8 5.0, Wonder Woman 1 6.5, Freak of Nature, Spider Man, Doc Ock 9 8, Captain America 1 5 5. Yeah, even a 10.0 Secret War 8. Yeah, wowza, right? Wowza. So, yeah, look at this one Action 17. Yeah. Wow, all kind of goodies, okay? So, let's see, let's go, there you go. All right, let's see, a lot of Golden Age goodies, but it was Spider-Man, Spider-Man 1, two copies, a 6.0 and a 3.5, okay? God, I have to take a look at this 9.8, Freak of Nature. Off white to white, look at this, oh my goodness, yeah, Blazer. Balaza, yeah, Whew. breathtaking, yeah. To see something, nineteen sixty-three. You, you talking? Goodness gracious, fifty-seven years old, yeah. How many fifty-seven years old look this good, right? Yeah, gotta be excited about that one. A lot of high grade, okay. Lots, if you can see, lots of high grade key silver age. That's what the feature auction is all about. Bring out your wallet. Wow. Okay, yeah. Great, high grades galore. Ooh, look at this 8.5. Now that's one of the highest grade copy of this book for sure. Yeah. I have an 8.0. But yeah. Nice. Look like there's a big issues here is on the bottom right here, right? But yeah. Look like a fairly graded 8.5. Nothing to complain about there. Wow. Look at that. 9.6, 9.4. 9, Spider-Man 41. When's the last time you see a 9.4? Yeah, of this book, right? Wow. Okay, let's... let's it's, now, please note, okay, I will refer to this when I do a market report later. 28, okay? Now... Let's see how many of that is comic books and how many is original art. Let's jump to 20. Page 20 is still comic book. Ooh, even a mask one and a mask two. Look at that. Look at that. But, ooh, look at this. Even an over street price guide. The very first one. Yeah, for those that collect price guide, there you go. You don't see this up for auction often, okay? You might see it once a year. Somewhere, either Heritage or Metro or here, but it's not something that come up that often. So that's a cool item. A lot of good stuff. Okay, so let's 
Um, let's see. I want to see how many of this is comic books and how many is original art. I'm going to jump to page 25. Okay, so original art 25. Let's have about 24. 24, yes, about 23. Yeah, so okay, keep in mind, each page is 50, all right? So 50 times 23, okay, that's how many comic book is in this auction right now less than that because like i said there's a whole bunch of original art showing up on page 23 so we will see we will see how this number will change um you know there is a theory a, be a belief out there that um a lot of the not so good stuff has already been thrown out there in the market in the, in the past four or five months so now all the good stuff are being held back. Okay, so we'll see if this uh, is a true. We will see if this is true, depending on what kind of additional books show up. Um, how about Amazing Fantasy 15? Did I not see any Amazing Fantasy 15? Not yet? No Amazing Fantasy 15. Can you, can you imagine? Yeah, no Amazing Fantasy 15 yet. That's a keyword. How about uh, now? I bet you there's not gonna be a nice Fantastic Four either. Because if there was a nice Fantastic Four issue one, you would have seen it in the thumbnail, right? On the very first page. So, my guess is there is not a nice copy yet. And my hunch is correct. Right now, you just have a low grade 1.5 purple. How about Hulk 1? 4.5, okay, mid-grade, decent looking copy with some Marvel shipping I can see. How about, of course, we gotta go with Hulk 181, right? No 98? <laughs> no 98, 96, 94, like I say, no 98 yet. We will find out, but my goodness, how about Batman? I wanna see the Batman one before I end this video. Let's take a look, yeah. Original owner collection. What does that mean? Is this a newly discovered book? Wow, you, you even get the back cover. Look at that. Aha, uh -huh, I think I saw why this is a 3.0. Even though it looked a lot nicer than it appeared at first glance. You see this here? You see this spine split that run halfway up the book? So it is not attached at both staple, okay? It is only attached at the top staple, look like it is detached halfway through. There's a cover split. Yeah, so, yeah. I bet you that's that um, spine split start right here, right where this tear is and right down. Uh-huh. Still, that's about right for 3.0, okay? But before we go, uh, let's take a look at that Captain Amer recall one. Ooh, two copy. One is restore, of course. Okay, this is eight point five, and one is a five point five. Ooh, let's let's take a look at the eight point five. Slight, slight, slight. Cover clean. That's it. What a bummer. What a bummer. Wow, I'm I'm gonna be very curious to see how this book will go as far as price. Wow, what a beauty! Only slightly restore, and the covers on. That's the only thing. No color touch, no piece added, no glue seal. Blah blah blah. Yeah, this might go for a good price, man. Yeah, I think so. I think this will go for a really strong price, even for a restore copy. How about the other copy? The 5.5 another one that say original owner collection man if, if anybody know more about what that original collection mean it is in a, a newly discovered collection that is submitted to CGC let me know I like to read up on this kind of stuff I don't recall ever see this book before so it could be a brand new book that had been submitted to CGC nice nice 
no major creases okay so yeah it's 5.5 but as you can see it's a little bit dirty general wears here and there but yeah it's a big reading creases right here on the edge right here right but I don't see anything glaring so for 5.5 that look pretty darn good anyhow I don't want to keep this video too long uh, thanks for watching I definitely looking forward to see what other books will show up in this auction in the next 16 days because there are still 16 days left for people to consign surely the number of books will increase significantly i think thanks for watching bye bye